Hmm. I wonder what this would be. Look at that. Brand new 1025R. 120R loader. The dealer I bought it from. Um, it has the new LEDs. Versus the turrets. The iMatch. Heavy hitch. All right, suitcase weights. And, let me zoom in. Single point from the factory. Um, I got more attachments with it. Like six attachments, not counting that in the weight bracket I ordered in. I went in and ordered a cart. I would like to have that cart in here where I can put that on and wheel it around. I'll order just the light duty. <sighs> then I can take the weights off if I have to. But yeah, um, I guess I'll go with my package deal. Um, so I got the tractor, the loader, uh, my dealer tossed in. The Versa Terps, they're loaded with uh, rim guard, eye match, and the tractor came with a single point. Um, the tractor was under 20 grand. <laughs> That's a lot to say. Under $20,000. Um, I went with the uh, Middletown Tractor Sales in Washington, PA. They give me a better price than um, every other dealer. Um, Bridgeport Equipment, Marietta, up the price. Up the price on it on me they give me a price for 18 was it like 18,000 then they upped it now 19,000 because it wasn't made no more and the day they did that and sent me the quote I called uh, Middletown and talked about one of the tax to see what they wanted for it and uh the sales guy I was dealing with was um Tony Tony's like she I tried to take care of you send me that quote ah see what I could do it came back with a hell of a quote, and I added more shit onto it. The heavy hitch I bought, the weight bracket, and the cart I just ordered. I ordered uh, brackets, which I'm kind of really disappointed about. They don't fit on the loader. Disappointment, but it is what it is. So I'm just going to sell a set to somebody. Did I bought a set I was going to put on the front and on the loader. I had to bore on hooks for the loader ones that kind of sucks one of them but it's okay I mean, we'll live um sorry my allergy's been bad cleaned out my garage that was bad i haven't cleaned it in a while but hey give it a uh, try for that price um <sighs> trying to think here they went with the uh, pallet forks or light duty i got they give me them for six hundred dollars and they're on the driveway, on a pallet. I was using them. Um, I got a rototiller, brush hog, box blade, land plane, and I went ahead and got the front quick hitch snow plow set up for it this time. I got a pretty expensive package. We're just going back to the dealer tomorrow to get the snow plow installed. They were like, you know, you could do it. I was like, I ain't paying. I paid you guys to do it. So you guys have put that on, which I think that's fair. Which we're speaking about this. Take set of those and have to mount them too on the front. So I'm gonna have them uh, put that on. Uh, my land plane, I got. I went with the Frontier 54 inch with shanks. That's still in order. I'm waiting for that to come in. I went with the Tar River 50 inch rototiller, gear driven. I went with um, Ideal four four foot box plate and a four foot brush elk. Yeah, I could have went bigger, but I always go, like, this size, I always go four foot. You guys remember I had my last one I had. The third function, I had power beyond the backhoe and all that good shit. I'm looking to buy the backhoe used, not new. Save some money. Um, get some stuff from TTWT, like the hydraulics on the back. Oh, the thing that come with was triangle, though. Surprise. <laughs> The brackets are not I got the toolbox from the original 1025 RU, believe it or not. I got two toolboxes. That's funny. And besides the point, yeah, I, I was gonna go with the Kubota and Kubota eh. Middletown did me a lot better deal. We got 10 hours on this. Oh. 
for 10 hours. Been great. I've been enjoying having it back. Having one back. He's a shit out of the loader. Brush all the ready. Love the tires. I'm a big fan. I've been wanting to try them out. Um, that's about it. That's a fair idea of video. Showing off. Not really did a video walk around talk a little bit. Might be a short video. I'm also going to pick up more weights for the heavy hitch. I like having a heavy hitch. But besides that, I'm happy with it. Guys, we'll see more videos. I'll get the GoPro. Oh, I picked up Milwaukee Weed Eater. I've been using it pretty good. Pretty solid. Got grease gun. Grease stay ready. No. Yeah, that's about it. Um. Oh, let me get over. I'll say that single point a little better. Yeah, this one is the one that comes from the factory. A lot of people like, you're going to regret it. I had one, if you guys remember, on a video. The hurl lines run up to it. I already rubbed on the hood right here. Right there. Taking the loader off. Besides that, no problem. Been happy about it. I do like it. I'll take the, take the loader off pretty easy. Um... My 54 inch snowplow will have the top link to use on this. My dealer's going to install it for me. Like I said, they're installing everything. So, yeah, I'll have that. And I'll shit, I might have my eye match by the time before I get to come home from work again. Uh, so, that's it. Uh, well, nothing else to really talk about. Yes. That'll be it for this video. And I'll see you guys on the next one.